Hello everyone and welcome to another CMC TV Talent with John Santos, where we are proud to showcase local talent and regularly bring you a new artist with two new original songs every week. Today I'm going to chat with an incredible young lady. She started singing at age three, but more seriously at age six. She goes to an art school and her goal is to be on Broadway. She's a singer, songwriter, musician, actress, dancer, and a mental health advocate. She has signed up for season 17 of the Long and McQuaid Singing Contest. Lately, she has been writing and recording at the SCJS Studios with Anthony Wright. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Ida Maria to the show. Hi, Ida Maria, how are you? Welcome Hi. to the show. Thank you so much for having me. I'm super excited to be here today. You are a very busy lady, wow. You have something scheduled every single day of the week. Watch this, watch this. What do you do on Mondays? Well, I have school all day and then I have dance classes. Tuesdays. I have dance in school. Wednesdays. I have pageant coaching and tutoring. Thursdays. I have pageant coaching, school and dance. Fridays. Singing lessons, dance. Saturdays. Dance and singing. Sundays. And then I have my pageant coaching again. Wow, you are busy. And on top of this, you go to school every day. You know, you gotta thank your mom for all that she does for you. I guess she drives you everywhere. Of course, honestly, she's my biggest supporter, biggest fan, and she's been there for me through all the highs and lows in my life, so definitely gotta give her credit for that. Now, you were only 12 when you joined a Juno-nominated girls band, Girl Power. Where did Girl Power perform? Oh, Girl Power was an amazing experience. I was there for two years. I've learned a lot about not only myself, but me as a performer, and it's definitely helped my songwriting and overall confidence. Now, you've done television and radio work. Where have you appeared? So I was on a TV show called It's My Party. I've been in audiobooks called Another Snow White. And I've also been on radio stations with Girl Power and as myself on 92.5 CHFI. Wow, very nice. Your goal is to be on Broadway. I understand uh, you already had a great start. We have some photos. Uh, please tell us uh, the roles of, of these uh, stills that we have. What was this? So this was when I played Anna from the musical Frozen. This was one of my favorite costumes. This is Catherine Parr from Six. Very nice. And you were in a TV show uh, called Odd Squad. Yes, that's actually my first ever acting job, and that's when I kind of knew I wanted to pursue acting in my life. It was a great experience. Wow, <laughs> one thing that impresses me is your audiobooks. What's the name of the audiobooks you did again? So I did the audiobook Another Snow White, and I played the role of Rose Red. Wow, really, really cool. What a great start for Broadway. Yes, exactly. Now, you are now writing and recording at the CGS Studios with Anthony, right? How yes. is that going? Anthony is amazing. He's one of the best, actually, producers I've ever met, and we just have a great time songwriting and recording together. Very good. How about singing one of those songs for us? I would love to. I'm dying to hear your voice. What are you going to sing? I'm going to be singing my new original called Love You From Afar. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Love You From Afar. The same story again Girl, love. Boy that she can't have any more We've heard it all before New girl Playing with your heart and You say You need me here just to be your friend So I keep playing pretend
Just incredible. Thank What you. What a nice Thank song. So Very nice song. Thank you. Um, have you been watching the show? I do. You have been watching? Yes. So, you know what's coming up? I know, and I'm so ready for this. You've been practicing? Of course. You know the questions and everything. Back of my head, yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, rapid fire is always fun. You ready? Yep. Favorite drink? Iced tea. Who is the inspiration? My mom. Why? Because she supports me in everything that I do. Summer or winter? Summer. Singing or acting? Singing. Favorite number? Five. Why? Because it's an even odd number, yeah. Favorite month? March. Favorite season? Spring. Favorite animal? Elephant. Color? Pink. Food? Lasagna. Vacation? Florida. Color? Pink. Wow, you are the best ever in this program. Wow. <laughs> Very good. Rapid <laughs> fire. People love rapid fire. Now, my friends, we're going to get to the main reason why you're here. Mental health. Yes. You were diagnosed with generalized anxiety disorder. Can you please describe what that is for those viewers who are not aware? Of course. Uh, generalized anxiety disorder is an uncontrollable worry or the feeling of being worried about basically anything or everything, even when you're in a different room and even when you're at home as well. So now you're using your own experience to help others. How is that? Exactly. So I created my program called Youth to Youth and I'm basically taking what has helped me, which is music and the arts, and incorporating that into a workshop while also other, helping other people who are facing similar situations like myself. Wow, well, something really neat is that uh, y y you were involved with the Minister of Education, Minister Lecce. Yes, I was. Please tell us what you're doing. So I am doing a workshop called Youth to Youth Global and I want this program to be part of the school system from grades 1 to 12 and so the Minister of Education Stephen Lecce has helped me to go to over 20 schools in my community in Vaughan and hopefully I'll be able to go to all the schools in Ontario to promote it. We're going to have to bring you back and we're going to have to bring Minister Lecce because this is a topic that I definitely want to get out there as well. You set up a not-for-profit, Youth to Youth Global. We have your logo. I want people to look at this and remember what it is. Actually, you know, I know that you are aware. We also work with a program called Back on Track. Uh, we're also working with kids at risk youth. 
uh, from the child welfare system and we should really talk how we can help each other. Very different but at the same time the same goal. Exactly. You know, we could be here for days discussing this. There's so much more we need to, to talk about, but unfortunately, we only have so much time. So you have to come back. We're going to bring, bring Minister Lecce next time. Yeah. Um, if people want to follow you, to know not just about your singing, but to know all about your, your uh, mental health, um, know all about your programs, where can they go to? So they can find me personally on Instagram, which is Ida Marie underscore official. And they can also find my non for profit at Youth Number Two Youth Global. Very nice. Sure. You can also go to the singingcontest.com and we're going to have some links there to Ida Marie's platforms. Uh, is there anything else you would like to say? Anyone you want to thank? I just want to thank everyone that's been supporting me through all my life. I know, especially my parents, they went through a lot with me, especially with my anxiety. So I just want to thank them for making me the person that I am today. And thank you for having me. I had so much fun watching the show. And just to be honest, it's just such an honor. You know, thank you for being here because without guys like you, girls like you, there would not be a show. I would like to thank CMC TV for promoting local talent. We're going to be closing the show with your musical video. Yes. Um, what is it called? It's called Today I, and it's another original of mine. Please describe the lyrics. So this song just talks about my journey dealing with anxiety, and although it has been a rocky moment in my life, it's made me the person that I am today, and I don't think I would have found the love for arts as much as I have dealing with my anxiety. Thank you so much for being here. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much. much. Thank you. You have to come back. Yes, for sure. CHHA 1610 Radio is promoting our guest music. Please go to thesingingcontest.com for more details. Well, my friends, this is it for now. Thank you for tuning in. Please don't forget us next week. This is Today I. Stay safe. Bye. with no invitation Should I ask how you are or should I already know You don't visit often as you used to and I can't say that I miss you You brought me up so many meaningful times in my life Today I thank you I appreciate the little things that I can Push my happiness aside